Hi guys, it's Paki and we have a full day of events on day three of Paris Fashion Week. First up, heading to the Roger Vivier presentation. See the artisan applying crystals meticulously on the handles of the bag. But this room is all about dreamy pastel watercolors. You can see the shoes everywhere. I'm now on my way to the Chloe Spring Summer 24 show. Hi Glacier, I'm Louise Wong and now I'm at the Spring Summer Chloe show. Chloe's Spring Summer 2024 collection was a send-off in style for Gabriella Hurst. It was her last as creative director and it was a stylish send-off. There were dresses covered with floral cutouts in leather. There were textured pieces that you know came to the ground. There were bursts of marigold yellow that provided a positive tone to the show. And some of my favorite pieces included the ruffles that were actually made from leather and that was a very beautiful and I think inspired touch on Gabriella Hurst's part. To end of the show, the designer joined the dance troupe and band on the runway for a very exuberant dance and it was a very positive note to the end of the time at the way. Just got out of the Jibashi show, it was madness because of Xu Ming Hao. First thoughts on the show, I thought it was a very light, airy collection. There were lots of, you know, organza overlays as well that we saw here. Uh, they were covering, you know, sheath dresses in floral prints. There were floral prints of irises on beautiful, beautiful dresses. There were leather pieces that I think would be so popular for Spring Summer 2024.